On surgery days, we typically have the patients come in at 6.30 in the morning. You will be greeted by one of my medical assistants who, you, who will bring you back to our procedure rooms. In the procedure rooms, they will go through some of your medical history, they will wash your hair, they will check also for any allergies and do vital signs. At that time, about quarter to seven, I will show up and then review the medical history and also go over the entire plan. The patient and I will go over specific details on how the procedure is going to go. We will design the hairline together and you, the patient, will approve the hairline prior to any, um, any of the operation taking place. Once you and I agree upon the operative plan, where the grafts are going to go, the proper hairline, and we've completed all the paperwork, including the consent, we will then go back to our procedure room or the operating room. Prior to that, many patients will ask for some type of medication to relax them. So we do have um, um, very weak medications and then we have stronger medications for, re for relaxation. At that point, um, we will then proceed with the procedure. Either if we are doing follicular unit excision, I will start excising the grafts and removing them. Or if we're doing strip harvesting, I will remove the strip. We will then give those grafts to my assistants. They will examine the grafts under the microscopes. They will sort them according to the size of the follicular units. So one hair grafts, two hair grafts, three hair grafts, or even four hair grafts. At that point, I will make all the sites for the graft insertion and in the recipient area. And then I and my staff will then place the grafts. If you have any questions, I refer you to our website, which goes into an in-depth discussion on this. Thank you. Thank you.